Hello everyone. Today I'll be taking a look at our new set of industrial beacons, namely the Industrial RX and TX. Like in other videos, I'll also be drawing some comparisons to previous models, like the Hardware 4.9 and Mini RX. As you might have guessed from the name, the Industrial RX and TX are intended for industrial purposes. By that, I mean non-office-like situations, when, for example, your forklift works both indoors and outdoors. So factors like temperature changes, rain, and dust will not break the beacon. While the beacons are IP67 rated, we would still like to emphasize that the beacons are not meant to work in the rain. What the rating means is that water and dust will not damage the device. Now what's good about the industrial beacons compared to the 4.9 and Mini RX? First of all, all of the sensors are protected. In these versions, the sensors are covered with a special membrane. This version is even more durable with metal sensors. Another plus is the external antenna, which the Mini RX doesn't have. This allows the industrial beacons to work in 433 megahertz frequency, in addition to 915. Finally, the industrial beacons are equipped with several interface options. First of all, you have USB through a special cable, then virtual UART over USB, UART 3.3 volt, and RS-485. Optionally, you can choose to replace RS-485 with CON. The industrial beacons support an external battery. It gives you flexibility as you can have a larger or smaller battery based on your needs. Another option is an IP67 rated power converter. Although we do have the battery as an option, we still recommend using a fixed power supply, especially in low temperatures because battery life is significantly reduced. So if it's possible, use a fixed external power source. In terms of sensitivity, the Mini RX is similar to the Industrial RX. Like we mentioned previously, the Mini RX can only receive and the Mini TX only transmit. The same goes for the Industrial RX and TX. This separation allows the RX to receive better than the 4.9 and the TX to transmit better. We have several versions of the industrial TX available. The standard 31 and 25 kilohertz plus 19 and 45 kilohertz for inverse architectures. More frequencies could be available in the future, but this is the current lineup. To sum everything up, the industrial set is a very protected model for harsher conditions. It's completely filled with a special compound which makes it really well protected from water and dust. It's significantly bigger and heavier than other models, around 200 grams. We're also currently testing out explosion protected versions, which will be commercially available on request later. Once again, if you have any questions, take a look at our forum, read our manual, and check out other videos on this channel. You can also drop us an email at info at Thank you for your attention and see you in the next video.